and December has chimed in the placement season for IITs, India's premier engineering colleges. The top offers have so far been a 4 crore rupees per annum made to students at IIT Delhi, Kanpur and Bombay. Akanksha Chaturvedi helps us get some perspective on these trends. Take it away Akanksha, tell us what are some of the top trends in the placement season this year. How is it compared to the last year and despite the big tech slowdown, that's the most important part. Why is it that despite that, the IIT placements are far better than last year? Oh, like you just mentioned, students have gotten offers that are paying them 4 crore rupees per annum. These are to students that went to IIT Delhi, IIT Kanpur and IIT Bombay. Three offers were made, not by an engineering company, but by a high-frequency trading firm, Jane Street. Moreover, many such offers uh, that are non-core, that are non-engineering jobs, were made to IIT students. Uh, companies like BCG, Bain and Company, McKinsey made offers related to uh, consulting. Other roles which IIT students, despite their engineering degree, they chased were in product management. So there has been this trend which is being noticed since the past, uh, you know, placement sessions that students are opting for non-engineering, non-core jobs. Experts believe that this is because the non-core profession might not pay as well as these uh, other professions, you know, in the management field might pay. Moreover, another trend that was noticed is the fact that the one crore plus uh, packages were more, you know, the number has increased at newer IITs like IIT Guwahati, but it has decreased in older IITs like IIT Delhi, IIT Kharagpur, IIT Bombay. More students, as compared to the last year, got offers that paid them more than one crore in new IITs, and this has not been the same in the case of older IITs. Another thing that was noticed is that many international offers, uh, students got international offers from countries like countries that are from the East Asia, countries like Japan, uh, Taiwan, South Korea. Instead of countries, usually, usually international offers were from countries in the Europe or from the US. But since uh, there is a looming economic slowdown in those countries, experts believe that the offers have reduced from there. And hence, the offers, international offers, are more from the East Asia. So back to you, Chetty. If you like the video, do like, comment, share, and subscribe.